week is kind of eventful for me because I've tried something new. Well, two things actually. So the first one, I've tried um, selling stuff online, as in clothes. It's just out of curiosity. Uh, I have some clothes that I don't use anymore. And apparently one of my friends in the group chat asked um, which kind of platform is the best for online for selling online, selling stuff online. And they said this website that I'm aware of because they have a lot of ads in YouTube. And so and, uh, I use that, I'm using that as well. And the process is kind of simple, but complicated in a way. Simple because it's actually simpler than I thought. Complicated because I have to get some things that are pretty far from my house. Um, by by foot actually it's not just by the bus so apparently it took me like four days to get my stuff sold I only sold like two things it's just a, like a tester and then they got sold four days later and I received a label to print and apparently I need to get a parcel box so yeah, that one is the hard one because I have to walk to the post office and it's not reachable by bus so I have to go buy the parcel box in the post office, fold them myself, print the label and then I have to go to the locker. So yeah, apparently when I stick the label then it's ready to be shipped and then I need to go to this place that has the shipping lockers and yeah. The process is actually simpler than I thought and I'm glad because I thought it would be more complicated involving some stuff that I don't know but it's actually pretty simple. And the second one is I am voting for the first time in my life on my behalf. So the official, I wouldn't say official, the date for voting for all Indonesians is actually on the 14th. But because I'm living abroad and I chose posting, the posting option, which means I'm not going to go to London or Manchester to vote. I'm just gonna go vote in my own time, in my preferred place. Then, yeah, I should be voting before the 14th. Or let's just say that the envelope, my, my answer, my choice, should arrive before the 14th to the embassy. Yeah. And yeah, this is pretty unique because this is my first time voting and I'm voting abroad and I would say this is like the most controversial election ever and for many ways and, I, and I'm pretty sure I explained the reason why in one of my vlogs so yeah it's actually mentally draining for me as well because I'm not participating in it and I don't go to any of their campaigns but I would say as a politics student it's really concerning in a way that it kind of burns me out mentally so yeah I just remember five years ago, I was about the complex ko di Jakarta. Isinya ada surat pemberitahuan. Okay, so cara ngobot di UK itu ada tiga cara, ada tiga pos itu pos pertama itu di London, kedua di Manchester, ketiga lewat pos. Dan awalnya itu sebenarnya pos ketiga itu di Glasgow, tapi karena cuma 95 orang yang mau ngebot di sana, nggak mencukupi minimum number of voters, jadi pindah ke pos. Ini kayaknya harus dipana tangan nanti. And then, hey guys, 
Berlin Surat suara untuk Presiden Yang kuning DPR RI Oke okay, ini envelope nya Ternyata nggak perlu beli lagi di pos Ada perangkoknya Terus Tata caranya Voting paper Ini untuk pilpres Ini untuk pilek Oke, okay, that's it Some of my friends are already like booking their tickets to London And this is just me vibing in my city And just going to bolongin the surat I'm not gonna do it, like I don't know This is such a public place But I think I need to read the instruction first Okay, so I think ini dua-duanya dimasukin yang upload besar Ini tata caranya Oh yeah. Jadi the first step is pastikan isi suara terdiri dari lima tersebut. Oke. Okay. Satu untuk DPR, satu untuk presiden. Terkasih juga kata cara satu kembali udah. Terus nomor dua coblos setiap surat suara sesuai dengan pilihan. Kalau presiden coblos satu kali pada nomor, nama, foto atau pasangan. Oke. Okay. Terus sekali. Terus ketiga masukkan surat suara yang telah dicoblos ke sampul asal dan pastikan tutup sampul dilakukan secara benar empat masukkan dua sampul isi surat suara yang telah dicoblos dan potongan tanda terima yang telah ditandatangani ke dalam satu sampul kembali terima kirimkan satu sampul kembali yang sudah terisi ke pos terdekat oke okay. so, yeah. 